Welcome back to WWE 2K22, man. And yo, we got something to talk about. We got some stuff to talk about, bro. Hey, I've been having a lot of issues with Rebecca, bro. I'm going to go ahead and show the clip as I'm talking. Um, first thing, when I first get into the match, they got me as Naomi. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. They got Rebecca as Naomi. Then after the cut scene, they switched back to Rebecca. You feel me? So I'm thinking, oh, ain't nothing. You feel me? Maybe it just glitched out. I win the match. After I win the match and everything, it shows the logo of the the uh, the show we're on, and then we go straight into a dark abyss. It stays in on this dark screen. Nothing move. Nothing happened. You just hear the crowd. Just all that extra stuff. Nothing happens. You feel what I'm saying? So I got out, came back in. The good thing is it allowed me back into the superstar mode. You feel me? So I hop back into it. Do it again, same thing happened. Do it again, same thing happened. So now I'm stuck on a loop. I keep fighting this girl. I keep winning. It keep putting me on a black hole. You feel me? So this is when I get to start testing things out, touching stuff, touch, uh, testing, you know, messing around. Now I do have a save file, an extra save file, but I ain't gonna lie, the last two videos, I have not even saved anything. I'm <laughs> I haven't saved anything, bro. And probably her record right now ain't probably even A1. You feel me? But uh, let me go ahead and show y'all what I've learned. Pretty much, Superstar mode, non-existent. You don't even need that mode. Like, that mode don't mean nothing. The only thing that Superstar mode is good for, really, if you just want to see the record. Let me just get straight to it. If you just want to see the record of the person that you are playing as, that's where you go to. The, the, the mode is very, very bare bone. It's no use for even having superstar mode at all. Only thing that do is just show you, you know, one loss, all the other stuff, man. That's the only thing because I don't see a, another way on her to show me, to show me how many matches she done played. There's no other way that I know of to see how many matches Rebecca done played so far. She done been in the, in the game for eight months. It shows that, but it don't show her record record. Like how many times, how many like her win, loss, and draws. It don't show that. Like I said, I was doing a lot of testing, changing some things up, woo woo. As you can see, she's a SmackDown champion because I was told that if you made any changes, if you switch over to uh, classic mode and you make any changes when you switch back to your superstar mode, none of that stuff stick. I'm here to call Cap. If I switch over right now, cause you know Rebecca is not the SmackDown champion. If I switch back right now, it will show that she is the SmackDown champion. Hold up. Go to her info. She's the SmackDown champ. Now, I don't know who I heard this from. I heard it from someone, but I forgot who I, uh, I was looking at, this was way before I even made a universe mode. Uh, I was just watching videos, trying to get acquainted with it and everything. You know, superstar mode is, is useless. That's the main thing that I'm trying to say. Superstar mode is useless. There is no reason to even have a superstar mode. You might as well just play on classic. Now, you might want to go to superstar mode if somebody want to know, oh, we want to know how many wins you had, losses, woo, woo, woo. Then you can go to superstar mode for that. But other than that, there is no other reason to go to superstar mode. So what I had to do, let's go ahead and get back to Rebecca now. Now, what I had to do with Rebecca, I had to sim that match. I had to come to universe mode, go to classic mode, I had to go to the show. I had to sim it. That's why we are on what we're on right now. Um, I was recording the gameplay and all this stuff. I still have the, the, the matches and all that stuff, but we got to that point. Yeah, I pretty much didn't care about it no more. I'm not even going to hold you. But I gave Bianca Belair to smack the, the Raw's champion. And then, oh, <laughs> Sasha Banks want the smoke. <laughs> okay. But I don't know if it was the reason because of the Sasha Banks situation because, you know, I did try to put us into a tag match. Right after I did that, we was in back-to-back -back tag matches. Then I got into a solo match, and then it, that's when it started glitching. So maybe I don't need to touch that or something. I don't know, man. Or maybe, like I said, it's super pointless to play um, Superstar Mode. I wouldn't recommend nobody play Superstar Mode. Just, that's just me. Now... I might have different a different outcome than everybody else. Now, other people probably go through it and it's probably smooth, easy, all that stuff. I'm just saying, me personally, I prefer not to even do that or touch that. Now, we're still going to have Teddy. If Teddy messes up at any time, I'm just gonna go and switch him over to Rebecca 
universe mode. I'm going to try to get his stats back to how it was and all that stuff. And we're just going to go on from there, bro. That's how we're going to do it. I'm already thinking about having an ultimate uh, universe mode where you y'all only going to get one week of a match per video, right? I want somebody on Raw. I want somebody on NXT. I want some. I want to. Uh, I want to even add NXT UK and then have SmackDown. And then I want y'all get what I'm trying to say, bro. Y'all y'all know what I'm saying, bro. And then give y'all that flavor. You feel me? That's the things that I that I'm thinking at this moment. That, that's that's what's processing in my in my my cranium at this moment. You know what I'm saying? I want an ultimate universe uh, universe mode. If I have to play classic, I want to have fun with it. I don't want to be playing classic. And I'm, I don't think I'm doing it, still doing like a uh, Rebecca thing. Like, nah, bro. So, but right now, we're only going to have one match. And that's that Rebecca versus Sasha Banks for the SmackDown Women's Championship. And then after that, man, we're going to go into a revamp session. And we're going to change up this whole thing, man. We're going to start trying to fix up this show. We're going to add uh, teams that's supposed to be teams. We're going to add, we're just going to do everything we can. We're going to download some characters, all that stuff. We're going to get this thing popping. If I got to play classic mode, yeah, we're going to do that thing. You feel me? But anywho, I've been talking enough. Y'all already see who Rebecca got to fight against. Let's go ahead and get into this thing. <laughs> Let go. Introducing the challenger from Boston, Massachusetts, Sasha. And introducing the champion from Atlanta, Georgia, the SmackDown Women's Champion, Rebecca Jones. Anticipation building to see who will leave tonight as SmackDown Women's Champion. All right, man, let's go ahead and get it underway, bro. This is the final. Well, it's not even the superstar mode. <laughs> but this is the uh, last time that you will see Rebecca in a, I don't know how to explain it. You feel me? Her little own superstar mode, bro, because we're about to mix things up. We're going to have multiple matches. We're going to have different things popping. Hey! We're going to go ahead and say I fell world wells by dropping off Sasha real quick. Sasha, I wanted to team up with you. Look at, look, the, look at the outfit. They match everything. Hey. But everything had to mess up, huh? Y'all also get a little glimpse of Rebecca New outfit. I told y'all I was going to switch her outfit up, change up some of her moves. I changed up a few. I didn't change up all of them. Uh, but, yeah, man. <laughs> I was ready. It's just a lot of things was happening. Okay. Good stuff. Oh, okay. Come on, Rebecca. Get up. Get up. Oh, no. Stay down. <laughs> oh, there's... No, no ma'am. Yeah, you're doing too much. Okay, good stuff. Nope. Hey, hey, hey. Let's go. Let's get it. But yeah, like I was saying, man, we're going to have a lot of things that's going to happen. I can finally do run-ins. I can finally cash in the money in the bank like it's supposed to. I can, yeah, I can do a lot more stuff now. And no, I can make robberies. I can end robberies. I can, I just can do a lot more when I go to cl uh, classic mode. I was trying to just keep it straight, Rebecca, but with all this crashing that's happening, and I think it's happening because it is superstar mode, uh, it's no use to stand there no more. And if I'm going to move over to a whole universe mode, it's no use to just having a singles universe mode. That's pointless. You know, when I can control every show. Okay, you're going to stop hitting on them. Hey. No, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Let's go. But yeah, that's, that's my thought process on it. He. Yeah, game time. 
Game time. Come on, walk, walk this way with me. Yeah, walk this way with Rebecca. Yes, ma'am. Get out of here. GG. It was fun while it lasted. <laughs> and still, the SmackDown's Women's Champion. All right, and then we already know. Drew McIntyre gonna win. Oh, Roman Wayne, Reigns still holding the title. Well, he got the title back because Drew the one that had it from the last time I remember. But yeah, man, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to go ahead and put y'all on game on all the stuff, uh, my thoughts, my plans, the things that happened, and and so on and so on. You know what I'm saying? Uh, the next time you see this, we will be trying to revamp this stuff. We will be trying to fix these shows up, get the right people in. I might throw some, you know what I'm saying? Let, let Rock, I mean, let Rock come back for a little bit or something. Man, I just want to have fun with the mode, man. That's all I want to do at this moment. I try to do the little story mode thing. It's not working. So now I'm going to do it my way. So all the ones that sticking by, supporting, appreciate you. All the other good stuff, man. Rebecca done had her issues, but she's not gone, man. We'll get y'all the next one, man. We out.